Ladies and gentlemen, it's my pleasure to welcome you to this expert talk. The topic today is IFAP tools and services connect your treatment process with new dimensions. My name is Andreas Samson, I'm your moderator, and in this case, it is my pleasure to welcome to the, my today's interlocutors, as they are Franziska Lehmann, uh, responsible product manager for IFAP, and my colleague Fabian Thön, responsible for business development in IFAP. Welcome. So what's the topic today? The topic is that Otto Bock walks the path of digitalization in the field of OMP together with our customers. And in this case, IFAB has established itself as a trusted partner to our customers, thanks to the extensive service and product portfolio a uh, long time ago. To underline this, we will see a short video. The world is turning digital. The world is changing faster now than ever. Accelerating the digital revolution. But digital isn't something we just do or use. Digital is something we have to become. Making the future now. Digital is connecting to unite our patients with their devices. Digital is empowering to enable customized patient care. Digital is limitless to achieve what has not been done before. Digital is revolutionary to make data a powerful tool for our customers. And that's why we invest in technologies to bridge the gap between digital and humanity. So we can enter the new digital world together. Autobock is digital. Autobock is human. It's very important for us as Ottobock to work with you on this digitalization. And here I'm coming also to my first questions to both of you. How does IFAB as an extended workbench fits in this context, Franzi? Yes, as already stated, for us it is really essential to walk this path of digitization together with our customers and partners. So we really have to understand the processes and needs of our customers in order to deliver them exactly the right products and services. And this is also very important to um, fulfill and to live our role as reliable partner and as extended workbench for our customers. We as IFAB, uh, we see as ex external partner uh, for our customers. We have over 20 years experience in custom-made products. Furthermore, we offer nearly all areas um, in OMP products like thermoform, prepack, or silicon or scissors and processes. Our future focus will be definitely in the digitization products uh, like CAT models for um, four models, what you see here in front of me, or in additive manufacturing products, therefore especially in the sources and processes. But only the products is only the one side. On the other side, we have to improve our customer communications and therefore we offer an ordering um, an ordering portal, the ICC, the IFAB Customer Center, where the customers can order their products and specify their wishes in this, um, um, about these products. To help this um, better understanding how we should serve the customer needs, we will extend um, the communication in the future and extend product portfolio here as well. To get a short overview about the production of the IFAB, we have prepared a short video what we want to show you now.
So it was good to see the IFAB uh, production. Fabian, I got a question. What uh, kind of experience do we have with international customers? Uh, well, so the experience are quite good so far. Um, especially in the beginning, it was a little bit uh, complicated because um, yeah, the language barriers uh, and um, that we do not see the patient, um, that is mostly an important part here, what was difficult in the beginning. But we see that our customers are quite open for the new technologies. Especially for scanning and digital modification, they are see the advantages and, and they see the possibilities, what they can do and how they should design. It's, it's very good to see the, the process, how this process will go forward. Furthermore, as in Germany, an in international area, the uh, customers have a special uh, shortage. So they there are not so many people who want to be in a uh, CPO or like that. And that's mean they search strong and external partners. And here, uh, that, is, um, that is where we stand for um, as an external partner for the production of OMP devices. And therefore, um, we have a very, very strong connection to our international customers. We have a very good uh, communication and intensive communication regarding products, regarding product developments. So in general, I could say uh, our experience are very good and only in, in the beginning we have some problems, but now um, it, feels, it feels very good to, um, to see that. That's good to hear. So Franzi, I got a question for you. Uh, how do we support our customers in terms of the digital transformation? So, uh, first of all, we really have to understand the current situation of our customers. How can um, new offers and opportunities in the context of digitization support them in their everyday work and in reaching their strategic goals? And what do they need in order to get started with digitization? For many of our customers, the entry barriers for digitization still seem to be really high. They fear high investment costs and long learning curves until the new processes are fully established. So here it's up to us to find ways together with our customers to lower those entry barriers and to support them during the digital transformation. And our intuitive software and scanning solutions as well as affordable scanning hardware are a very important first step therefore. Understand. What are the challenges, Fabian, uh, in regards, regards uh, of our customers and digital transformation? Um, well, so uh, normally CPOs work by hand and uh, they take the measurements by hand. They make the plaster cast by hand. And this is everything will change completely with the new um, digitization tools uh, like scanning and uh, modification software. And we see, in the, especially in the beginning, that uh, the CPOs do not trust the new technique. But um, over the years, um, we show them the possibilities, um, how to use the software and the easy way how to use the software. And then the, um, our, um, this, our customers, also especially the CPOs, see uh, that it's not so, so difficult. The quality is quite well, even much better. And um, therefore, yeah, the challenge in the beginning was to change the complete the treatment process from analog, like plaster cast, to um, digital modification. And the other thing is, uh, there was the investment. To, um, I think five years ago, when we start uh, to offer our um, CAD CAM solutions um, to our customers, the investment of the scanner and the software was in the range where we say it's okay. 10 years ago, it was completely too high. And today we see much more scanners, which comes with better prices on the market. The software is not so expensive like uh, 10 years ago. So the investment barrier is still broken now. And that's why we see that the complete digitalization becomes more and more common in all over the world, even in areas where the um, financial situation or the reimbursement system is not so strong. But reimbursement system, that is another challenge. New products like the 3D printed CAD CAM products um, or additive manufacturing products. Um, yeah, we have to clarify the reimbursement system that these products are uh, an 
alternative to the current um, products or even better uh, than the current products that say um, yeah we'll get the, um, give the money to the patient care houses that they can provide and uh, treat their customers with these products yeah there's a, there are still challenges definitely I, I, definitely, I definitely absolutely i got a question for both of you um, how do we see the future of ifab yeah i think i will go on um, yeah, the future will be that we will extend our product portfolio, uh, especially in the additive uh, manufacturing or 3D printed products. That is one of the big goals. And the other goal will be um, that we will extend uh, our communication with our customers. I think, Francie, you can say some words here better. Yeah. Uh, so in parallel to developing new products, we will also further develop and enlarge our IFAB platform, the IFAB Customer Center. So new functionalities like, for example, order tracking will further improve and simplify the communication with our customers. And additionally, we are constantly developing our scanning and software solutions in order to um, deliver our customers a seamless um, digital journey. So um, please um, get in touch with us uh, and let us know how we can support you in order to benefit from digitization. What do you need and what do you expect from us? So we are really looking forward to shaping the future together with you. Yeah, thank you, Franzi. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, I will take this as closing words. Unfortunately, we are at the end of our expert talk. I want to thank you guys for your insight into this topic and a special thank you, ladies and gentlemen, for your time and attention. Stay healthy.